Greetings, seekers of astrological wisdom. Today, we are going to look how to determine whether the person you wish to communicate with is at home using horary astrology. I am William Lilly, the author of Christian Astrology, and I shall guide you through the astrological keys to unlocking the whereabouts of those you seek. As ever, the Ascendant and its ruling planet represent the Querent. For the person you're trying to reach, we look to the seventh house and its ruling planet. This approach holds true whether you have a familiar or frequent interaction with them and they are not related to you. Now, suppose you're seeking to communicate with specific family members. If it's your father, look at the lord of the fourth house. For your mother, consider the lord of the tenth house. Should the father seek connection with their child, focus on the Lord of the Fifth House. Similar principles apply for other relationships, simply adapt the rule accordingly. This technique becomes a versatile tool for any interpersonal situation. A crucial step lies in assessing the location of the Lord of the Seventh House. If it rests within any of the angular houses, it is a clear indication that the person is at home. Should this lord or the ruler of the individual's representation house occupy a succeedant house, then they're not far from their dwelling. However, if their significator finds its abode in a cadent house, then they are far away from home. When the lord of the ascendant is applying to aspect with the lord of the seventh house on your intended day of connection, it is likely you may encounter them on their journey home or receive news of their whereabouts along the way. Keep an eye on any planet or the moon separating from the Lord of the Seventh House and transferring its light to the Ascendant. This unveils their location based on the characteristics associated with the involved planet. If you look to the planet's nature, its sign placement, and the quadrant of the chart, you will be able to determine whether they are masculine or feminine, depending on the planet that represents the person. Dear astrological enthusiasts, you now possess the astrological key to uncover the presence and whereabouts of those you seek to communicate with. By reading the astrological signatures, you tap into a profound understanding of human connections. Until we meet again under the stars, I am William Lilly, and this is Christian Astrology.